All right. All right, I'm going to start the governance work session now. If everybody would, uh, who hasn't returned to the table, if you could return to the table. All right, so this is where we look at the operational expectations monitoring report and talk about whether we have other measures um, or changes to the report. So I have to say that this is kind of a milestone tonight. This is the first board, re the OE monitoring report, where we've now come a full year. Um, a year ago, we, we had some very minor changes that we had talked about putting in here. The governance committee has put all of this on our pending list because we thought that it didn't make sense for us to be changing some of these, these smaller items when we were looking at new measures for, for the strategic plan. So we have put everything aside, um, and this is the first where we've gone a full year. Um, last May we had, um, I just wanted to read to you from what we said last year. Um, we had some next steps which have been answered. For future reports, we wanted a little bit more information on Major 2.6. We wanted information on Blueprint for Change, which of course we've adopted. There were no suggested changes for the learning environment. So what I want to throw out to um, all of you is if, as we're looking at the strategic plan, if there's anything in this report that, um, that was left out, something that we need to add to our list of things to put in the strategic plan that isn't in here. Um, other than that, I think we can, um, we can maintain what we have. Any questions, any comments? No? Okay. That being the case, then we don't have any more uh, next steps for this. We will just uh, continue to incorporate the, um, these into the strategic plan uh, measurements. So the only other thing I have for governance is I'm supposed to give an update for governance. Um, we are continuing to work on the July retreat. We had asked for people to let us know when they would not be available of three dates in July. Um, I think we're probably going to end up with July 18th because we've only heard from a few people who um, about their their lack of availability and it, and it appears that more people can come on the 18th than on, on others. But uh, do let me know and, or, and let Mrs. Goddard know um, if you have a problem with the 18th uh, because it does look like that's what, what we're going to stick with. Uh, the only other thing I have to update is that we did approve um, we approved language. Um, we decided that we wanted to have option B as the method that we're using for the main budget motion, which we'll be using uh, next week, I assume. But we do need to put language into the strategic governance manual, and uh, so that will come to the board at a, um, at a regular board meeting in the future, probably, I believe, uh, Madam Chair, in June. Is that your intention? And that, I believe, is all I have. Uh, anybody else on the governance committee? <laughs> no, I am getting applause from Ms. Smith. So that's it. Did I stay within my five minutes, Mr. Velko? Oh, wow. That's, it's already over? It's already over. Yeah. Do I get those minutes back at a future date? I just got my call. Yeah. Okay. Uh, this committee, the, the, this work session, excuse me, is over. And in one minute, at 7.55, two minutes. Oh. Okay. The budget work session will be coming up soon.